guys, it's Kristen with Simply a Steward, and I am back today with a Vitacost haul. So, um, I'm thinking the days of 20% off coupons are gone. I have not seen one um, since before COVID hit, and so I went ahead and had a, I think a 15% off for my anniversary of signing up with them, and so I went ahead and placed an order um, because we needed some stuff. So... The order has come in and I have unboxed it and it is kind of sitting in the box so that I can share with you guys, but I need to get using some of these things. That was the reason I ordered. So I'm going to flip the camera around and show you guys what I ordered today. So here are the things we got, guys. Sorry, I am outside. It is actually beautiful and it has been so like insanely hot and humid, like 90 six to 98 um plus humidity so today is not that way and so i'm spending as much time as i can outside so yes i am doing a grocery haul on my porch <laughs> don't mind like the grass because it's barely rained and so it just rained the past like two days and so we have like grass going crazy all of a sudden since it hasn't been mowed but anyways these are the things I got um I will just start over here I got chili and you can see cumin seed these are both spices that I got in larger sizes so um let me see if I can find the weight okay so 16 ounces there you can see I bought these because I make my own um taco seasoning and these are two of the things that I was out of and so I will just make a big mason jar full of taco seasoning seasoning for when we eat on our tacos um so I picked those up those are I think they were close to ten dollars a bag maybe um I got some of these, Jovial. I love to pick these up whenever I can. Um, we don't eat them that often, in all honesty. I don't think we've eaten them probably really since we've had COVID, maybe even like once. Um, but there's something that's nice. It's shelf-stable, and we can keep around. Um, so we bought four boxes of these. We buy all the all different shapes, and it's just whatever we have. We bought the elbows this time. It was what was on sale. A lot of times I've been seeing, we've seen shortages Um <clears throat> Sorry, guys, I'm losing my voice from filming so much. Um, <clears throat> we've seen shortages on foods, um, on the Jovial noodles specifically. And so I just want to keep kind of stocked up, like I said in my Costco video, of some of the things that we eat so that through the winter time, when we do eat these a little bit more, we will have them. So every time I order, I kind of just try to order a couple, even if we're not eating them that much, um, we will have them if it comes to the point that we need to eat them so um but my kids really do enjoy these and they are they are the gluten-free organic um they are soaked so they are sprouted if you're not familiar with what that means that means they soak them and it changes um like the <clears throat> changes how it works with your gut health and even my kids who have problems with brown rice um, noodles in general like if you go to somewhere say like like um, Aldi and get the G-free ones. We struggle sometimes with those with our gut. These ones do not affect it. So I love to have those as a healthy option. I picked up some more of these. Um, I do get the dark ones because they, I believe they have less drink in them. But um, let me see if I can find it. There you go. Unsweetened chocolate and cane sugar. So yes, it does have sugar, but it doesn't have anything else in it, which I love. So um, we did get those. We do use lilies as well, but lilies are very expensive, and right now they are just not fitting in our budget. These are even expensive for our budget, but I do like to have these on hand um, sometimes for, like, our uh, breads and things like that. So everybody wants a special treat, you know, once in a while, especially when things are having a little bit more of a rough time. Sorry, guys, that filming went a little bit haywire for a second. I was trying to reach for my bottle since my voice keeps going out. There we go. Um, okay, so the down here, I got this Paleo Mix. This is a fairly small package. Um, you can see my hand. I, did, I was hoping it would be larger, but it was only like $5. They used to carry this Birch Benders um, Paleo Pancake Mix at Costco. We have not had it at our Costco in a very, very long time. Um, and so the ones that they, this is what I get for my mother-in-law when the kids spend the night, she just takes this and she can add, um, add water. I don't think you add anything else. Yep. All you need to do is add water and she can make pancakes. So at home I make my pancakes from scratch all the time. Um, but since that's not the way she normally cooks, 
it's a little more difficult. She's used to something like Bisquick. And so this is really good for her for when the kids spend the night and the kids don't end up eating junk. So I picked this up um, because she was out of the ones we had bought at Costco. We had bought her kind of a mini stockpile and they ran out. Um, and like I said, Costco's not carrying it anymore. So I picked that up. Um, these little bottles that are rolling all over. I don't actually typically get these. Oop, that's going to fall. The wind's blowing. Um, I don't actually typically get these on Vitacost. I usually get them on, um, yeah, I got a dog hair attached to that. Sorry, guys. I got, I get them on Amazon, but these are what we use for when we get tick bites. We live in a place where ticks are very prevalent. Um, I, Seriously, hundreds of ticks in our house have come in and been attached to our children um, or ourselves. So it's it's not something that's new for us. So this is something that we keep on hand at all times. Um, just as a homeopathic remedy, I'm not giving out um, any advice here. Uh, it's just something that I follow myself. Um, and we do it as a prevention if there has been a bite. Um, and knock on wood, since we have done that, we've not had any issues with limes. We have had issues with limes in the past. So um, I keep these on hand all the times. When I got on, there was a the I had the percentage off. Um, I don't remember if it was my anniversary one or if I had the 12% um, this time. My anniversary is last time. But nonetheless, we had that coupon. And then there was an additional coupon specifically for this brand. Um, which made each of these bottles, I think it was five fifty, and I usually pay at least um, seven seven dollars, sometimes eight dollars on Amazon. And lately, they have even been up to ten, twelve dollars. Um, and if I run out and that's when I need it, then I, I'm out of luck. I have to spend like ten or twelve dollars on it. And so when I saw these at five fifty a bottle, I went ahead and made sure that I picked them up. So you had to spend twenty dollars to get. Um, the extra off and that's why I bought four of them so that's fine we will have them on hand um, I got two of these I prefer the Redmond's um, real salt garlic salt but they have been out um, a lot and so I we are we still have from my last order but I didn't want to run out of it because this is probably the most utilized spice in our house and so I picked up two of these simply organic ones um, which you can see here. So I don't love the fact that it has organic rice concentrate added into it. That is not in the Redmond's, and that's why I prefer that. But it's it's a fill-in, and I like I do love the fact that it's garlic. So, or uh, sorry, that it's garlic. Yes, but that it it is organic. So I picked that up. We make our own balsamic vinaigrette dressing. So I picked up two more bottles of this. I still have a couple bottles in the cupboard. But again, this is another thing that just seems to be going out of stock. And when you get low stock and you can't get a hold of the things that you need and the things you use, the supply and demand, the price goes up. And so when I did need it, at like, you know, and would have to go to a store and buy it, it was through the roof and it wasn't organic. So I was happy to at least pick up a couple bottles. Um, I grabbed two of those this time. And then I got six of these um, almond flour pizza crusts. And if you guys have seen this before, there's the ingredients for you. Very simple, very straightforward, very good, um, clean ingredients. So I call this the Simple Meals brand. I call this the Betty Crocker of the healthy living. Like they have, you know, very clean ingredients and they're very simple instructions. So I'll just flip this around. And like I said... It, it reminds me of like Betty Crocker, right? So um, my daughter loves to make those. It's super easy. So we picked up six of those. We use two of them every time we have a meal. So we still have some, but I, I don't like to run out. So I picked those up as well as because I was I, this is the thing I needed. Pizza sauce. I was out of pizza sauce. We have been using it, um, extra pizza sauce for our... Uh, zucchini we have a ton of zucchini that's come in and my kids like to make like a zucchini um, breadstick where I shred the zucchini and make it um, essentially into a breadstick and they dip it into pizza sauce um, and so we've gone through pizza sauce like crazy so I was out of pizza sauce so I needed that the most and that's why I placed the order so but I made sure I ordered enough um, pizza to to have some of that pizza sauce in there too now I will say I was disappointed you can see here my can is severely dented. 
So I have never had that happen at all with Vitacost products. Um, but it did happen to um, two or three of my cans this time, which was really upsetting to me. Um, so I did contact them as soon as I opened it because it was a couple days after I got the package and we were gone most of the weekend. And so I opened it like on a Monday when my husband went back to work and we weren't doing as many family things. And when I found it, I messaged them and they were um, very quick and easy to refund my money. I almost wish they would have just sent me new products um, because in order to use to get the free shipping, you have to be I think it's over $50. So um, but they did refund my money with, uh, without any questions asked. Very short, very simple. Um, so uh, shout out to them for at least, you know, getting that done right away. I've had some other companies where first off you kind of get the run around and second off when you, when you do, you have to kind of wait five or six days for your money to be refunded or whatever. No, it was back in my account in no time. So, um, and the very last thing I got was this one degree cereal. My kids love this. It is expensive. We used to do it every Sunday when we first swapped over um, to eating healthier, um, but now we don't do it very often. It was kind of funny. I laugh because when we didn't eat quite the lifestyle that we eat now, my kids would have cereal quite a bit. They ate a lot of like Cheerios and Life cereal, um, those types of things. We didn't eat the, the super sugary cereals, but they did eat a lot of cereal. And then um, on weekends and stuff, we would have you know, maybe waffles or pancakes. It was like a special thing or muffins. And now they eat waffles and pancakes and muffins every single day. And cereal has become the special food. But this box alone is like $5 roughly. It had been um, cheaper with coupons a while back. Um, but again, the price of things just seem to be going up. And the budget right now with... Um, with the way things are going uh, currently in the economy, the budget has gone down. Um, so, I but I did pick up one of these so that they could have one uh, one of these weekends here coming up in the future when they are home. I have a feeling they may be having a sleepover this weekend, so maybe not this weekend, but you know, next weekend. So, that was um, the last thing that I picked up in this haul. So that is everything that we got in this haul. Um, if you guys like these kinds of videos, I definitely have other grocery hauls up and we'll continue to make those. We do live a um, healthier diet. I can't say perfect by any means, but healthier. So those are the types of hauls that you will see here. Um, go ahead and make sure you click that thumbs up and the subscribe button and we'll see you guys all next time. Bye.